waiting for three hours to finally play this freaking game. Let's do it. What's going on, my fellow gamers? Welcome, welcome. Factor the game here. And welcome, finally, to Red Dead Redemption 2. The whole purpose of Undead Nightmares playthrough was to get hyped for this game. And if you're not hyped for this game, well, you suck. We got horse testicles. I know that's the biggest thing people are uh, excited to see. Uh, that's good. Uh, on, on TV. We are using TV. I'm using a different capture card as per last time, so we're going to have some fun with this. Story mode, baby. Story mode. Let's hear it. No trespassing. You know how it goes. Game, take it away when you're ready. I don't think the game's ready. If you're not aware, this is a prequel to the first one, so we are not playing as John. We're playing as his cohort of his old gang. So it should be a fun time. I've actually never haven't seen any gameplay of it. I refuse to watch any of it. When I get hyped for a game, I don't watch anything on it, so I'm going to be surprised my first playthrough of it. I don't get hyped often. And unfortunately, like, literally, there's two games I'm hyped for for this year, and they literally have, like, 20 days in between him. If that. So, you know where the other one is. It's my home state. We're gonna have fun. Is it time? It's loading. I don't think it's time yet. By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at its end. America is becoming a land of laws. Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Rockstar Games presents Red Dead Redemption. Oh my god. I'm playing on PS4, which is weird for me. Thought I'd change it up for once. Second game ever ever playing on PS4 recording was. Take it away. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. If it's weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Chapter One, Coulter. Bring him in here.
Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. But what really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Uh, oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We need you strong. Okay. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. All right, let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Holy cow, I can't get over this. Like, the graphics are amazing. Careful over this bridge here. That version of up more ice on it. Unrealistic expectations. Three out of ten. I believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. Ooh, I'm up. And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. It'll be safe for now. But we sure can't go back there to collect it anytime soon. Is that a challenge? Wait, is that someone coming towards us? Who's 
here. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found hey. anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Yeah, he was. Both of them calendar boys is. Er, <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean. We all know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Coming past. Go on. You sure about this, Micah? Mr. Morgan, I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Been kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp back up the hill. Huddled around a fire, waiting for Daddy to put food on the table. Said it before, we got too many mouths to feed. Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. I earn my share. You think it's unreasonable to expect others to do the same? So, this house... You speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us. Look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders. You know me. I'm a good boy. Right. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not far. Mm, thanks. Are we there yet? Oh, goddamn, this snow gets right to the bone. Oh, Dutch is still with us. He's in the van. As expected. Are we going to uh, John's home? I wonder. Or are we going to Blackwater? This looks like the Great Basin. To the degree. Because I know the map is different. But it's not that Okay. Different. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. I think it is. Okay, let's head down there. Holy cow, the snow footprints are amazing. Like, I've never been one for graphical detail. I'm seeing this, and I'm like, holy cow. Hey, you get the stash on it. Oh, it's hell. Mother thinks I'm about to get in a fight. In. Good chance. Okay. Weird. Way to put it. Let's hitch up here. First the hitch. Whoa. Poor horses. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. You got it, Dutch. As weird as that sounds. No, I don't know about that. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. Go to the shed. Okay, I can do it. Arthur, take cover in that shed over there. I'm working on it. Yeah. 
there. Over in the cattle shed. The what? The shed? Arthur, get in position. Come on. I'm working on it. This isn't it, is it? Hello? Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the train. Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. Now, I, I just Arthur. need... Some There's a body food in the wagon. Uh, I hear you. Just Devil. keep your eyes on Dutch. Over there. Oh, oh my God. Okay, that's my gun ammo. Didn't seem to be going too well. Goddamn, O'Driscoll boy's here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. You got it, Dutch. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Food? Uh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Canned vegetable, that's nice. So it's the only thing I have. That's cool. I like that. My little help. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead. It's about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. At some Oops. point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. So, Square is searching, which is a little different. I'll take Place blankets. is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they all oh, get Jack. back. I don't really want us to split up. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Health cure? That's weird. Meet me out here when you're done. Let's go upstairs, see if they think they can get up here, and then we'll head back down with Dutch. We gotta be a good, uh... Homeboy for Dutch. Revolver cartridge. Oh, cartridge is my favorite. Even in real life, that's a preferred weapon. What? Uh, let's head out. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur. Go see if there's anything in that barn. 
Micah, you search the cabin. See what we missed. Go to the barn. Sure. And before the barn has like 100 people in it randomly, because that's what happens. Press down the meter and jack it, not to worry about that. Southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. Get the hell out of here. Go. Probably too nice to get. Where is my gun? Why is my gun over there? Do I really have to pick it up? Wow. Cattleman revolver. My hat. Really? I mean, granted, you can't be a cowboy without a hat. Easy. You're okay. Yeah, okay, boy. Oh, what horse buying achieve? Who's that to be? That's awesome. Okay. So I have a new friend. His name's Horse. Yeah, figured he won't get far in this anyway. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. You need to hitch him. He's already skittish. Get away from me! My God, what the hell do you think? Oh, I found in the cellar. Why up there, Gage? Leave her alone. I wasn't doing yeah. nothing. She's one of them O'Driscoll's. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Yeah. Are you... Oh, you fool. Michael. Miss, now, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on. Now. Be nice and warm in there, though. Oh. Are you okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Arthur. Miss, it's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll get we ain't bad men, but we ain't Figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Somebody's coming! Looks like
back is Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Is the main character cool?